This short video will show you how to pair the Clipsol 755 RFB2 wireless base and the 755L PSMA4 lithium wireless smoke alarm. Firstly, install the wireless base and fit a 755 PSMA4 or a 755RL PSMA4 smoke alarm. Unpack all lithium smoke alarms and keep them nearby ready to pair. Select either the wireless base or one of the lithium wireless smoke alarm units as the master and apply the sticker provided. We recommend the wireless base for simplicity. Apply power to all alarms. On the master unit, enter pairing mode. To do this on the wireless base, press the wireless pairing button three times quickly within two seconds. The red LED will come on for two minutes. If the lithium alarm is selected as the master, Press the test hush button three times quickly in two seconds. The network LED on the back will initially be red or green, then will turn blue for 30 seconds when in pairing mode. While the master unit is in pairing mode, the slave units can now be paired. On the slave lithium smoke alarms, press the test hush button three times quickly within two seconds. The network LED on the rear of the alarm will come on for three seconds indicating it's paired. It will be red initially if pairing for the first time and then it will turn green. If the wireless base is the slave unit, press the wireless pairing button three times quickly within two seconds. The red LED will flash four times indicating it's now paired. Repeat until all units are paired. After all units have been paired and the master's pairing LED indicator has turned off, you can start testing. Press and hold the test hush button on the 240 volt smoke alarm that's fitted to the wireless base for more than 20 seconds. Within 4 seconds, the smoke alarm will start to alarm. After approximately 20 seconds, the paired lithium alarms will sound. The alarm sound is a continued pattern of two beeps. This will continue for one minute. Check all smoke alarms receive the wireless signal and are alarming. Now install all smoke alarm units. It is recommended to test from each unit to check the system thoroughly. Press and hold the test hush button on each of the units for three seconds and then release. The unit will start to alarm with three long bursts. Once the test hush button is released, the other paired lithium smoke alarms will start alarming for 10 seconds and the red LED will flash. The alarm sound is a continued pattern of two beeps. The sound differs to make it easier to identify the initial triggered alarm. At the same time, the 240 volt alarm fitted to the wireless base will also start to alarm for 10 seconds. Once all units have been tested, the installation is complete. We hope this video has been informative. Thank you for watching.